Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to make a transformation effect. First of all, go to the end of the first video. The click on composition, save frame as and select file. Name as number 1, and press render button. Now do the same with the second video, but make sure to save the first frame of the second video. Name it to, a second video, and press render. Now go to the folder you have saved this frames and open in Photoshop. In Photoshop select remove tool and remove car. Now save it as a photo in JPEG format in the same folder. Do the same to the second photo, remove and save in the folder. Now go back to After Effects and import the two images there and let's start with first clip. Place on a timeline first image. Then from the end of the first video, press and hold shift and press page down twice, cut there the image. Do the same for the second image, hold shift and press page down twice. From the start of the second image hold shift and press page up do go back. Place your image and videos like in this video. Let's animate transformer effect. Duplicate your first video, then go to the end. Right click, go to time and select freeze frame. Cut that layer and place it over the first image. Let's mask out parts of BMW. Select pen tool and start masking bumper, then duplicate the masked layer. Press M on duplicated layer and delete the mask, then mask another part and do the same process to all parts of the car. I've masked out all on this BMW and now let's do the same to the Porsche. Duplicate the second car layer, go to time and select freeze frame. Move duplicated layer over the image and cut it like in the video. Do the same masking for this Porsche. Mask out all parts. Mask out. Duplicate the layer. Press M on duplicated layer and delete the mask. Then create new mask to another part of the car. Once you've finished masking, you can start making the effect. Select all masked layers and press P on your keyboard. Create a keyframes for position on all of the masked layers. Go to the middle and move car part something like in the video. Then go to the end of BMW layer and move parts close to each other, like in the video. Do the same for Porsche layer, select all masked layers press P on your keyboard and create a keyframe on all of the layers. Start moving parts like this. Go to the middle of the layers and start moving parts far from each other. Go to the end and copy and paste first keyframes to the end of layers. We almost have the transformer effect, a few more adjustments left. Select layers and press U to open keyframes. Select all keyframes and press F9. Also enable motion blur on your timeline. Do the same to another layers. Select all the layers. Right click and pre-compose them into one layer. Let's make a shake effect on transition. Add markers where the transformer starts and ends. Go one frame backward before the first marker and add a twitch effect to the layer. Create a keyframe for amount and set it to zero. Set speed to 15. Expand enable and toggle on light and slide. Go forward where you have set first marker and set amount to five. Now go to middle of the markers and set amount to zero. Press U to see keyframes and if you need to move them. Now go to the second marker and set amount to 5. One frame forward and set amount to 0 again. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.